incompetent, naive, impotent, lacking judgment, integrity, the sheer will to use such magnificent power. What? What, what on earth is this? Dark magic? Beautiful, isn't it? This magic is just the tip of the iceberg. You shall perish by it. Be saved by it! Ah! What on earth are you? You, it's your time to die. You arrive. Fill my consumption. Now die! Wingman! Are you okay? What? What did you do to her? That wasn't me. We should be safe for now, though I do not know where we are. Listen, I had to get us out of there. He could have killed me. No! Ah! Why on earth did you do that to me? He could have killed you, but not us. Together, we're a formidable force. But entering the wielder's mind? Alone? I understand your anger. You don't understand my anger! We had them right in the palm of our hands! Hemlock, you don't know what I saw. Oh, oh, there she does it! You're calling me by my witch name now? You're just as nonsensical as that wielder! How ironic! Contrary. I know more than you think, Hemlock. We had a deal, so watch your tone. You're right, we did, but I think I'll be taking my business someplace else. That will be a mistake. I want this wielder as much as you. His power can help me live a better life. And what life is that? Some fabricated, happily ever after family reunion? For a fair deal of time, you've seemed like the perfect sadistic malice of a witch, a great partner, filled with such bitterness and enmity, and I would be the same to you. No. Hemlock, that was never our agreement. We kill him, Scarlet! Drain his power, take his soul, slit his throat! I don't care! We use our magical harm upon those who wronged us. Then we take all of what we want. Hmm. No. No, the wielder stays alive. Turning a new leaf, huh? You yourself like judgment, Scarlet Witch. A fatal flaw. I suppose doing this solo would be more beneficial. You aren't even close to seeing the limits my power can reach. If you do this, you will regret it. I doubt that, honey. A full body of power is better than half. Hmm? 
Huh? Hello? Hello? What do you want? Did you hear me? I said, what do you want? I am you. We are one. I want to consume and grow. I don't understand. We want to consume and grow. To grow what? Our power. Hour? How do you even? I have been lurking since the beginning. Human, I have seen all your victories and all your defeats ever since you touched that fragment of great power. I don't understand. You cannot comprehend it, then you do nothing, because you can do nothing. So stay out of my way! My lord, now that we made landfall, what are our following orders? I did not wish for any unwanted guests to be alerted to our presence. However, I fear coming out of Lightspeed to arrive on this island will draw many eyes. Secure the site. Prevent any of this island's inhabitants from intervening with our mission. Yes, of course, my lord. Shall stay vigilant to any abnormal land folk. Specify. Um, well, Jedi, rebels, will any be situated here? That is unbeknownst to me as well as you. Regardless, it should and will not concern you. Only me. Do you understand, Stormtrooper? Roger that, Lord Vader. We know the Empire's occupation here. Find our key, the relic, the Sith holocron. Find it. Retrieve it. Let's move! I'm telling your highness, as soon as this thing started assisting me, she just fled. It's as if she knew what it was, it struck fear to her. A witch expressing and conveying fear to her adversary, huh? That's a surprise. Whatever it was, you should watch yourself. Be careful, you understand? We don't know the capabilities of your power, and God knows if it's sentient. Yeah, I've had my fair share of that for many years. Uh, not a fan. Zip it, you! 
Just because they can't see me does not give you the right to show off. Listen, I know you're getting all angsty because you're homesick, but your assistance will be much appreciated. <laughs> After the way you've been speaking to me, you're my avatar. No, oh, grow up. That, uh, sorry. Uh, bird issues. Oh, right. Anyway, I know we won that fight by the skin of our teeth, but those two are still out there. So, what do you propose? You cannot be considering going after them. That's exactly what I'm considering. She knows it's something I don't. Nah, oh, for crying out loud. The Scarlet Witch knew exactly what this thing is inside me. This power. Maybe I can get answers. Or she could tear you limb from limb with the snap of a finger as soon as you arrive. Exactly. Plus, I'd much rather remain here to observe and protect my kingdom. My people need me. But you can't def defend this place alone, King Malik. <laughs> Who said anything about me being alone? I'm so glad you arrived! I thank you for coming here. Of course! I'd never let an old friend down! How's business? Booming! Quite literally. The parties have been top-notch! Until, well, the assault from those two Maleficent individuals. I heard. Your little friend here told me everything she saw. She's more polite than you are, King. Well, treat others how you'd want to be treated. Hello, King. Hey, Wingman. Sky, I'm glad you're okay. Seems like I missed out on all the fun, huh? Fun? I wouldn't call it that, miss. Wingman, I won't hold it against you if you wish to chase that witch down. She did seem the most fragile out of the pair. But me and Evie will remain. The Rave Cave needs my protection. I was talking to Evie and... I think I'll stay too. Don't worry. I can help them take care of this place. I'll go with Wingman. I got your back, kid. And I've got yours. That sword contains a tremendous amount of power, the likes of which I have never seen before. Your sword becomes your greatest weapon in battle. Use it to lead the charge on your journey, like I once did. <laughs> Someone's a bit too attached. <laughs> what can I say, with it being bestowed upon me by my father, it channels the spiritual synergy of my great ancestors. Take care of your sword, and I will take care of you. You shall do great things, my man. I believe. You have my word, Malik. Yeah! And I've got my swords, too. Together, they destroy and vanquish great evil. <laughs> yeah, you too, Sky. Who can I forget? Shall we get moving? Imminently. Good luck! You know where we are! That old IO command is just up ahead. Shouldn't be that hard to pinpoint due to the loud music blasting from the parties being held. Copy that. That's what I like to hear. Hey! State your business here. Um, it's a free island. Get after your helmet, pal. You're trespassing on Empire territory, rebel scum. 
I suggest you drop your weapon and leave before we use lethal force. We don't have any weapons on us, so uh, if you'll just let us pass, we'll leave you be. Non-compliance, I see. Change of plan. You're coming with us. You're answering to our lord. Listen, mister. You'll refer to him as Lord Vader. Right then. <laughs> look, you look like a swell guy, Lord Vader. Hmm. Okay, stern but uh, caring, right? Scientist? Are you trying to annoy him? Um, I can assure you. We, we have no quarrel with your people or your faction. We protect this island. We would never steal from a reality birth from the zero point. Very well. You seem competent enough to know how that particular action would end. Poorly for you. Myself, but uh, I think there's a whole lot more to her backstory than we know. <laughs> 